Good morning, everyone. So we are on our way to the Inner Harbor. Um, so we're gonna view Baltimore a little bit. There's not much to see in Baltimore. And then we're gonna go to a game. Um, and we ate crab last night. Um, just a matter of opinion, I don't think any crab is worth the amount of work to get to that little bit of meat. So crab was good, but again, just a lot of work. Not worth it for me. Um, I prefer uh, crab cake. Anyway, morning. I'm like a turd. My. here. You may remember me from such films as Wake Up in the Morning. <laughs> We're here at the Baltimore Harbor. It's so pretty, honestly. Um, and it's really quiet this morning. So um, just walking the harbor, getting some shots. Um, and you're allowed to fly, fly your drone here, apparently. Mm -hmm. I just learned that today. They don't care in Baltimore. <laughs> Um, but again, so pretty. And luckily um, we used actual laws to find out, not some random dude on a, the walk over here uh, that she spoke to. Anyway, very pretty. Hey guys, so we're at the Northern Art District Station. It has amazing graffiti alley. To me, it's a hidden treasure because when you Google Baltimore attractions, this does not come up. I had to watch other people's travel vlogs and I found this place. It's somewhat empty, it's a nice area. All the vlogs that I had watched said the area was sketchy. That's not true at all. Maybe because, you know, we be in the Bronx and the Queens of New York. <laughs> that we don't feel that way, but I feel safe. I don't think it's a sketchy area at all. There's a parking um, right across the street and it's really nice. You'll see other photographers here um, doing shoots and stuff like that. It's just really pretty and I think it's worth it. Okay, so we're uh, on our way to Camden Yards to watch the Yankees chip up the Orioles. Um, been a dream of mine to see the Yankees play in every stadium uh, in the country. So uh, last year went to see them play the Mets, and then obviously I've been to a ton of games at Yankee Stadium, so uh, that doesn't really count. But uh, first one uh, out of state, uh, pretty far, I'm pretty excited. So uh, we should go there, chip them up, do what we do. Uh, go from there. Go Yankees! Woo woo! Come on, say woo woo! Woo woo!
welcome back to our channel. So per usual, we always give some tips, advice. Um, so for this Baltimore, Maryland one, um, my advice is just to be aware that the, be aware that the uh, Inner Harbor is going to be crowded. Super crowded. Um, there was a lot going on that day. There was a cheerleading competition, a baseball game, a charity marathon, and then not including tourists. So it was extremely crowded, so just be mindful. There's also um, a lot of attractions in the Inner Harbor itself. Um, Ripley's, believe it or not, the Hard Rock Cafe, the Sugar Factory. Boba de Ken. Yes, the USS. Um, Something. Yep, mm -hmm. uh, Boat tours, uh, so again, Oh, and I think there's a museum or there's, an aquarium. There's a lot of really cool stuff, and actually, a beautiful, it's a beautiful harbor. It is, and such beautiful views. So again, due to all the attractions and the harbor itself being a top attraction, it's going to be crowded. So if you want footage or, or video, um, footage or photos like we got, you have you do have to be there fairly early. We were there at 7 a.m. Yep. Uh, also went to the Yankee game uh, against uh, the Orioles. It was a great experience. Uh, first game for me outside of New York. So uh, pretty excited uh, to go and uh, definitely blew me away as far as what they uh, offer. Uh, great play area uh, for kids. So uh, slides, pictures, jungle gym, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, all sorts of things that if I wasn't uh, 34 years old, I'd be doing. <laughs> yeah. I don't have a kid, so rolling up in there and starting to play isn't gonna be a really good idea. But uh, a, lot of, a lot of really cool stuff. Uh, a family atmosphere uh, there as well as uh, set up almost like a town so small shops obviously different types of food different things you can buy and uh, just all around great experience uh, when you go to the shop uh, there they had all Yankees gear there so uh, obviously Baltimore gear with Yankees gear uh, something that they may switch in and out so I don't really know if that's a specific game mm -hmm. or there's thing, or maybe also there. a lot of Yankees. and the only reason why area. I say that is because the game itself looked like a 50-50 split with Yankee fans and, and Oriole fans so uh, very comfortable. The fans were very respectful. Always something you worry about when you go into a different stadium and how they're going to take you in. If you can wear all the gear and not have an mm -hmm. issue, you know how drunk are people going to get? Is it gonna be a problem? But <laughs> or uh, fight or fight. But uh, all around, uh, I guess you know going into the you think that way. But no, all around, uh, uh, great experience and uh, you know loved it a lot. Uh, we won too, so you know. Yep. But shout out to you, Baltimore fans, yep. uh, for being so welcoming. Um, you guys are super great and again your stadium is absolutely beautiful. beautiful. It's like a, a neighborhood um, That's just very welcoming. So um, So for more travel videos like comment subscribe our next video is going to be Dumbo, New York again We live in Jersey um, But we don't always get to see what New York has to offer even though it's in our backyard uh, so we are visiting Dumbo which is trending and like upcoming especially for tourism uh, so we it's our we're gonna be our first time there and we're visiting just like tourists <laughs> Anyway, bye guys Was that better? It was way better. Okay, so you're you much better more. when you, you're much better when you talk less <laughs>Then they might come peck you. Plus, you might kill it. You out here giving it chocolate. She's like, You think I should no. give it a cake pop? <laughs> I don't even <laughs> hate the cake pop. Ready? Come on, babe. What am I? Am I recording now? Yeah. Is it recording? Yeah. Hello, everybody. Rob here <laughs> <laughs> reporting to you. Uh, no, you need to start over with that. I need to <laughs> think about this for a minute.